Page, don't draws. Please welcome me, myself, and I, OJ Abraham. And his opponent across the ring in the blue corner, wearing the royal blue trunks, coming from Croydon. He weighs 10 stone, He's undefeated as a professional. Ten contests, ten wins. Nine of those wins coming by way of knockouts. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting Wayne Alexander. The officials appointed for this contest, the timekeeper, Mr. Peter McCann, the referee, Mr. Tony Walker, who will now give his instructions to the boxers. Well, this is an interesting one. Wayne Alexander earmarked for the top. But O.J. Abrahams, as you've seen, is a fellow with bags of confidence in his own ability. And I have it on very good authority that O.J. Abrahams is going to try to jump on Alexander early on here and test his chin. There's one or two whispers around the game that if Alexander's got a weak point, it might be that he can be vulnerable around the chin. Let us see what Abrahams can do. On his night, Abrahams can be dangerous. Southern Area Championship, Alexander says he will become British champion and defend it twice this year. Alexander, the big prospect in the blue trunks, the black of O.J. Abrahams, who comes from Watford and is an avid supporter of the Division I football team, wore one of their shirts into the ring tonight. He's going to get a warning to the head here, Abraham. She's ducking it low. Well, he's trying to break Alexander's ring of confidence by roughing him up quite clearly. This is trying a little intimidation on Alexander. You saw him in the stair up just before this fight took place, and that's what he's trying to do. Just psych Alexander out of it. Oh, and again, the very liberal use of the head, and Alexander complaining to the referee, saying, look, what is he up to here? And Tony Walker's going to have to be very, very watchful. It was a good right hand there by Abrahams, and Alexander, to be fair, took it okay. And I think he's having a deduction here, one point off. A point deducted for O.J. Abrahams within the opening seconds. He's pretty hyped up, isn't he, Abrahams? Yes, he's really got him, himself hyped up too much and he's in danger because he's keeping that head very low. Got him with another right hand. And Alexander being put under pressure and he tried to knee him there. He tried to knee him and he's tripping, thrown out. Abrahams has been disqualified in the first round. Well, what on earth was he trying to do there? He tried to knee him in what looked the most painful area of a tour uh, without wishing to be too direct about it. Well, that was ridiculous, wasn't it? It really was. A terrible performance from Abrahams, who could have been dangerous. Instead, he's made himself uh, a hole full of enemies. A disgraceful display by Abrahams, you know, he just, he proved nothing by doing that, he had himself so psyched up, it was all the roughhouse tactics he could come out with, and he'll really regret what he's done tonight. Well, this is the second headbutt we're going to watch now from O.J. Abrahams, who clearly went into this with the idea of messing up and roughing up Alexander, but he just took it to ludicrous proportions. It's silly, silly tactics. What on earth he was trying to prove with this? There he is, boring the head in. And then, most outrageous of all, he tries to knee Alexander in the groin. In there. You can't quite see it there because the referees are covering the shot. Let's see if we uh, can take another look at this. There's a low blow. And then that, look at that. Oh. 
Well, ridiculous performance from Abrahams. Why he had to do that. It was a good opportunity for him to try and do something. Caught by a little right hand by Alexander there. And then the knee. Still trying to get the head in as he's got the knee in. It was, I mean, he didn't even try and do it sneakily. It was blatant for everybody to see. And he deserved what he's, what he's got. And Alexander is the Southern Area champion, but he wouldn't have wanted to win it like that. Ladies and gentlemen, after one minute, 30 seconds of the first round, the referee has stopped the contest and has disqualified O.J. Abrahams for deliberately fouling his opponent. The winner, Wayne Alexander. No dispute at all about Tony Walker, the referee's decision there.